everyone, Elaine Coe reporting for AbWeb from Sun and Fun in Lakeland, Florida, where we have been following Redbird Simulation's one-week graded a solo program. They have three students who started Saturday morning and they're pushing hard to get them ready to solo in Red Hawk Diesel 172s by this coming Saturday. Here's Charlie Gregor for Redbird Simulations to tell us more. What we're doing here is uh, uh, an event called One Week Ready to Solo. And uh, essentially at, at its heart it's a it's a public demonstration that uh, that learning to fly is more accessible than people think. And so what we've done is we brought we brought the tools that we use every day at Skyport, the, the software and the hardware device, and we're putting three people through this from zero time all the way to ready to solo by the end of the week. A couple of the technologies that, that make this possible are, are GIFT. Uh, GIFT is a, is, a, is a curriculum, it's a set of uh, training um, training modules that's built on the trace technology, which allows the simulator to watch what the pilot's doing, react to them, and provide training and real-time feedback. Uh, so, th so the students can get in the sim and, and, and enhance that training. It, 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 it allows them to uh, absorb the information and process it much, much better than you ever could in the airplane with, uh, with everything else that's going on. So once they've learned the maneuvers here in the sim, then they'll transition to the airplane and it's a relatively simple transition. Plant City, we're flying uh, our Red Hawk aircraft, two of our Red Hawk aircraft for these uh, students. They're uh, the CD-135 uh, uh, Continental engine on, on essentially a fully refurbished 172 airframe. Uh, um, it, it allows us to do this flight training at a fraction of the cost of the Lycoming engines. And, uh, and and super reliable, very quiet, uh, very uh, very easy to operate. Uh, there's not a lot of messing around. There's a FADEX system in it, so we're not worried about engine management or anything. We're just worrying about flying the airplane, which takes another barrier away from the student learning to fly, especially in this time frame. If you want more information, you can go at aopa.org and look at the one week ready to solo page on their uh, their site there.